You guys, what's up with all these Walmarts being closed? Like, it's the second attempt today that I tried going to a Walmart and it's freaking closed. Like, and it's just taking all my money. The first driver, who's very rude, I had to get, uh, well, I guess he ended up canceling a ride once dropping me off and I went through like the Lyft customer service and stuff and I rate, gave him back rating and everything. So he was just so rude and he said that he didn't want to drive like further away if I was like changing and stuff. And so I caught another ride and went for like 19 something dollars. Took me all the way to this Walmart and it's freaking closed. The guy said it had a fire. I'm like, what's up with all these Walmarts catching on fire? So now I went in for another Lyft ride to give me a ride to another Walmart that's costing me like just about 30 bucks. This is so crazy. Like, this is ridiculous. But you know what? The other driver, she didn't know. So I'm not going to try to get like a refund from her because I'm not that type of person. She didn't know. So I'm not going to do that. But it's just crazy. But you know what? God got me, you know, because I have true intentions. But my ride is, I guess, supposed to be showing up. This may be my ride right here. But um, yeah, you guys, I'm leaving. <laughs> Right now, I am about to spray paint Thomas's bike because thankfully somebody had donated um, dumped this bike for Thomas, so I'd have to pay for it at all. It's for me during this bike camp, and so it was a pink bike, even though he's a boy, so he wasn't feeling the paint, even though we are grateful. But someone gave me an idea, we just spray paint the bike, so he chose the color blue. So I'm about to start it off for him because I don't want him to mess up his bike, and I may have him get a chance to do it himself. So keep on watching how I spray paint this by. I don't wanna make a mess. <laughs> I do. Hold on, but I'll let you do some of the other times. You like it so far? Yeah. Like a rag, try to wipe through that off. Oh, I mean, yeah, it's gonna come right off. Yeah. Are you guys ready to see it? Get my hands. 
<laughs> but um yeah i just had my it was cold i just had my son go inside to watch the baby but um i tried you guys um i don't know if when it is dry if i could like find like a rag or something and take off some of the paint from the parts i don't want it like certain parts of the wheel or if it'll just naturally come off but i try my best you guys so uh let me know what you guys think and my son he knows how to ride the bike really well so that's good but see how it's like on the wheels um i did all that side though i try to get like the little details try not to get like the wiring but obviously got on some parts of the wiring you guys can really see but uh yeah i think i did a good job or see just like certain parts like the wheel like see how stuff like dripped a little bit and just got a little bit on some of the metal but i try not to touch the water spot the pedals the wheel you know that type of thing but uh what you guys think though i think i did that for the first time what do you guys think it's another close-up view it like that i think i hit all the spots though but let me know if um if i could use like a soapy rag or something for the wheels like you know like just the little spots to just take off let me know what you guys think hi you guys i am at work it's been a busy day but i'm hanging in there i've had 17 checkouts today and i'm almost done i just have some double rooms to do i'm finishing up this king i'm actually done with this king room um the doors closed behind me because safety reasons based off what just happened in texas so my job was just being just extra extra you know careful and um yeah so i'm about to show you guys a little snippets of the next room that i cleaned i just ran out of some of my um one of my chemicals that i use but it's okay because the other one is just fine i'll just use it for everything um but yeah i'm a little short on the doubles I may need another king. I'm not sure if I have extra ones still on me. But sometimes we just like run out of things and we just have to wait for like the night, like the next load. So yeah, you guys. Um, so just stay tuned and just a day in life with me and hopefully I soon get up out of here. <laughs> so let's get it.
morning, guys. Just got done paying my car insurance, you guys. I had to pay $637 and some change because um, I was on auto pay for my car insurance and they told me that I was, at first I thought it was on the 18th and they said, if you have auto pay, it comes out like the 20 something. So I'm thinking, you know, like closer to like the 30th. But parties have a lot going on. I've been getting like a call and I finally looked. I'm like, why is that my insurance lapsed? And I guess they're trying to say it was on the 22nd. Mind you, I had the money. I just took the money out of my one account and switched over to a savings account. Or else my stuff would have been paid, but I didn't know. So I had to pay extra, you guys. My car insurance is five eighty something, and I had to pay six thirty seven because they did that for the, um, I guess, reinstatement and then for a late fee. So, and then I'm like, this is the worst time because it's like I'm dealing with a whole car claim thing right now. But he said everything should still be fine. So, right now I'm about to call my adjuster and let's see if she answers. So that a call the social security office too. Your call may be monitored or recorded for quality assurance. Darius, um, this is Marissa Jones calling um, to just basically get an update on everything. You give me a call back on my cell. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, everybody. I just got off the phone with Social Security office, and they said for my two kids, um, they cannot do birth certificates, but I could do just a shot record within the 12 months. It doesn't have to be the full record, but it could be the shot record. And um, thank God she said... Um, Oh, yeah, it has, has obviously like your name and date of birth on it. And thank God she said that it won't take up to six weeks. Um, most Some people get usually five business days, so like five to ten business days. So that's great news. So I just want to update you guys. If you guys was ever curious on how to get replacement cards for your kids, and now I know future reference, do not sign off on them unless they are 18 and older. 
I didn't know that. I wasn't told that ever before. I never had this issue before with it being signed when people would ask for their social security card. So that's why this kind of got me. But probably because it's for like a certain apartment. That's probably why. But there you go. Probably by like, uh, I would say five o'clock, like five p.m. Uh, my name is Mar what can I get for you? Yes, I would like that fire truck and station cape. And um, yeah, it just says fire truck and station. That's what it says from looking at at it online. What was that? Oh, okay. Um, I guess it'll say happy 13th birthday, Zachariah. And I'll tell you how to spell it when you're ready. It is. Okay, perfect. No, that'll be all for now. Okay, thank you so much. You too, bye bye. Hi, you guys. So I'm just now leaving the Social Security office. Um, he said I could treat Bill, get the cards by next week. So I'm excited about that. Um, and I just got done ordering my co-worker's son birthday cake. And, well, that's because his birthday is tomorrow. So I was said that I don't have a problem ordering his cake and everything. And, you know, get on some balloons and stuff. So, yeah, you guys, I'm about to leave and head on to my next thing I'm trying to take care of today. Hey you guys, so I'm about to get on the train. But before I get on the train, I want to just update you guys. So one of the new things I have coming up for you guys, which I'm excited about, I'm requires health and fitness. And I'm very, very excited to share this with you all. So today I'm making some footage of me getting, looking at some affordable workout clothes because your girl, I won't be that bougie, but I will get that stuff in due time. But my store, DD Discounts, that I happened to fall in love with recently, I saw one day that they had some nice, you know, workout clothes for cheap prices. I'm talking like $5.99, $6.99. So it wouldn't hurt to probably get like three of them. I won't need that many. Just to get started on my journey, I would like to share with you guys and everything. So I may get a little bit of footage of that. And I'm not gonna keep this vlog open too, too long, but I hope you guys enjoy it. And make sure you guys are liking this video, watching the video thoroughly. Let's get your girl to at least 300, 500 likes um and more <laughs> of course but let's get somewhere okay and uh, make sure you guys show some love on my videos hit the push notifications Mwah. thank you
now at Didi Discount. Are you trying to get it? Yeah. Thank you.